Hi there Friday people. I am actually alone this time. Hope you've had a good week. I have to say I haven't. It's been a nightmare but it's coming on for six o'clock for Magic Chardonnay Hour and I wanted to say hi to you guys. I'm going to start with a couple of cliches. <laughs> cliches must have told the truth to have become cliches. I'm going to merge two together. The first is that you get love by giving it away. So corny but true. And the other is that the shortest way to a man's heart is through his stomach. So it's Dave's birthday. So I'm going to put those two things together. Normally on a Friday, uh, we get takeaway. We have pizza or Chinese or Indian or whatever because we can't be bothered to cook or we've got guests or we've got guests Saturday. So I thought, well, I'll get him what he likes and so on. So I emailed him and said, um, you know, is there anything special I'm going to the shops? And he said, here's the challenge. He said, now, nah, surprise me. It can be a test of how well you know me. Coming on eight years. So what I've got is this, okay? I've got some sun-dried tomatoes, gherkins and olives as a kind of starter because he doesn't do sweet stuff. He really only does savoury. And then I'm making here um, Paul Hollywood's uh, ring roll loaf, savoury, with some, I've got some lovely Stilton and some uh, nice bacon to go in. So that's going to rise and be a savoury filled loaf, I hope. It's beginning to rise. And then I've got some nice sausages to go with that. So the loaf is instead of pasta or rice or whatever. And then I've got an onion gravy coming on here. Onion gravy is Dave's speciality. He showed me a couple of weeks ago how to do it properly. Basically, he said, reduce the hell out of it. And we start with a full pot and it goes down to half and it's so rich, it's not true. It's going to be really, really good. So that's what I've got. Of course, there's a nice bottle of champagne, which I can't show you because I can't open it yet. And the glasses are ready and his favourite um, almond milk juice, if that's what he would like to have as well. So there we are. Um, for afters, there's, I've got some two different French cheeses. Uh, I've got Roublechon and some Ordinary Brie and some nice grapes, you know, which can't really go wrong. And biscuits for cheese. I don't get biscuits for cheese. The French have real bread. But here in England, we have biscuits for cheese. And Dave's taught me that you can't offer cheese courses without biscuits. So his other present, I have to tell you, um, apart from the one that I can only hint at in the title, because this is a family show, um, is, wait for this, I'm going to show you, is a target for his latest toy, which is this little monster, which they bought to go camping with. Um, but I have to say, we put the target up in the garden already. It's a tripod with a great thick foam thing and you pin targets to it. Um, this is so powerful that the flights have gone straight through the foam. Um, in fact, we haven't yet recovered a flight, whatever we d we've done. When we tried it out first, um, with targets on the oak tree, they just buried themselves so far into the um, tree that we couldn't recover them. And the same with the decking and so on. It's a serious piece of kit with a proper viewfinder. And I think we're going to have a lot of fun with competitions. You have to respect it. I mean, this could kill somebody if it was misused. And um, they bought it to go camping and wild hunting with, um, but didn't catch any game in the end. So in England, we don't do that kind of thing. And of course, we don't have guns, so it's, it's this. Um, so that's where we are. Um, I have to tell you, at dawn on Monday, where going off to Madrid and then Valencia. It's my third time in Spain this calendar year. Um, we've hired apartments with uh, three other couples, all straight couples, um, university friends of Dave's who have become friends of mine and we kind of see each other most weekends one way or another. They looked after the cats for us. One of the couples, Sam and Steve, thank you for that Sam, um, uh, a few weeks ago when we were both away for the weekend. Um, so it's going to be good. Uh, <laughs> I hope I hope this rises. Pray for me. By the time you see this, 
It'll either will have fallen flat or I'll have a most wonderful loaf. I'll put pictures up on my Tumblr. Okay, do go and have a look. And um, that's where we are. Okay, if you've had a rough week, first week back at school, first week at university, you know who I'm thinking of. Um, I hope it went well and that any frustrations, for example, are being outed when you ask not to be. Um, can be sorted out and um, the weekend's great here in England the sun is shining it's going to be nice okay have a good weekend have a good week and hopefully I'll film something in Spain maybe with the others and we can do a joint hello all right take care bye bye for now